Hello and welcome to this edition of Dealing with Brightspace. Today what we're going to be looking at is the inclusion of a tool to check for plagiarism. Now plagiarism is when a student either purposefully or by mistake copies material from another source and essentially doesn't give credit. Although there's some academic limits as to how much you can do that even though you are allowing for uh, uh, credit. Uh, we want our students to write their own paper. So there's a tool built into Brightspace that allows us to turn this on and have uh, assignments that are submitted to our classes be checked for plagiarism. Now this tool only applies, as far as I can tell, to assignments. So you can't go into quiz answers and do that or go into discussions and apply the same tool. So the tool I'm going to be looking at seems to be only available for assignment. So let's take a look at Brightspace now. What we're looking at is my psychology, my intro to psychology master class. And you'll find access to the plagiarism detector under assignments. And you go right down to plagiarism checker. And it brings you to an interface that essentially lists all of your assignments, right down here. And then over on the right hand side is where you can turn on or off the plagiarism detection. So you simply use the little slider, and I say yes, and I have now turned on the plagiarism detection for chapter one assignment. I can then select this little slider if I want that report sent directly to the students upon their submission. Then this might be a tool that we could use. So let's say we wanted students to be able to self-check themselves for plagiarism. We could create a Dropbox with two efforts. They can do, they can do it twice. The first one, they submit and they get their feedback on the plagiarism checker and then they're allowed to submit it again once they've made all the changes as recommended by the plagiarism software. Now another part of this interface uh, is going to be here's the number of documents submitted. These are the number of documents analyzed. This is all the, the way it's been updated. Due dates all for that specific assignment. If we go over to the other column here, plagiarism submission details, we won't see much here because there's nothing submitted yet, but if you go to filters, I can then look at different assignments and dig deep into, um, into specific assignments by specific students or groups and whatnot to, uh, to take a look at what they've done. So that's it. So this is built into Brightspace. You go into the assignments tab, go down and go into the plagiarism checker and turn it on for whatever assignments you want to have your students and or you utilize those tools. So, hope that was helpful.